Good morning, everybody. So I'm going to show you the armature for the coil or coral, excuse me. So we just finished the one for the seaweed. Um, and remember these ones, we used three wires and they were shorter. Well, this one, we're going to do one, two, three, four, five wires, and they were a little bit longer. So they went basically from my elbow to the tip of my fingers, right? So as long as yours is kind of somewhere in there, it should be totally fine. Now, five wires can be a little bit more tricky than the three wires, but it's basically the same. So you're gonna, in the middle, you're gonna hold it flat and then you're gonna twist it again, twisty, twisty, right? So you've got it twisted. So that part's the same. Now this next part is gonna be a little bit different because we're gonna be making the kind of coral shapes. So you're still gonna kind of bend it so it's a little bit taller, right? But now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna separate three of the wires. Now, if you pick three wires that are kind of next to each other, that's probably the easiest. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna start twisting just those three wires together. Now, I just do it with my fingers because this 18 gauge wire is like hecka easy to bend. If for some reason you're struggling with just bending the wire, like if it's hurting your fingers or something, you can use the um, pliers for that. But really, like this wire is so small, it's super easy. Okay, so now I'm gonna do a little bit of mending with just those three parts. So I made it about from my you know, tip of my finger to my knuckle. So these are gonna be a little bit different shapes, a little bit different sizes, and that's okay, because nature does that, right? So now that I have this part twisted with the three wires, I still have those three wires extra at the top, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold one of those wires over like this okay and now i'm gonna hold right next to where the wire comes to you know comes back to touch and i'm gonna twist this side like this okay so i'm just gonna twist it i'm gonna keep twisting it until it gets pretty close to the end it gets a little bit stiff when you get to the end and if you're having a hard time twisting uh, you can either use your pliers or if it's this small or smaller, you can just kind of like pinch it together like this, boink, just to make it a little pokey, okay? So you're going to do that to all three pieces. So again, I just, I folded it over and now I'm going to hold near my, uh, this main part over here. I'm just going to twist, 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 twist twist, twist, twist until it gets kind of difficult. And then once it gets a little bit difficult, I'm just gonna squish, I'm gonna pinch it, pinch. All right, and then I'm gonna do my last one right here. Twist, 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 twist. Now, groupings of three, really odd groupings tend to look better than even groupings. It's just something in your brain is like, ooh, that has more visual interest than something that's totally even. Um, it's just kind of the way it is. So that's why we're kind of going for three on the end, but we're also gonna have three of these. So I'm gonna do the same thing with some of my other wire, okay? So I'm gonna take these three over here and I'm gonna do those three and then I'm still gonna have four, I'm gonna have four left and I'll talk about that in a second, okay? So just to review, you're gonna separate three of the pieces and just like we did with the last one, do, 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 let me get that around, uh, get them kind of ready to go and then you're just twisting, twisting, twisting. And if it's not, you know, perfectly neat, if you have some little, you know, funky bumps and stuff, that's totally fine. It's coral, it's nature, it's, it's all good. So you're gonna go again, something similar to, you know, finger to knuckle. It could be a little bit longer, it could be a little bit shorter. Uh, it's totally fine. But once you get a little length, you're gonna take those three extra pieces, like so. Remember, you're gonna fold it over so it's close to here. You're gonna hold it uh, flat with one hand and then you're gonna twist it. Do, do, do. And when it becomes difficult, you're just gonna pinch it. Mm -mm. Mm. Boop. Okay. 
Do, 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 do. Here we go, same thing. So I fold it over, I twist it until it becomes uncomfortable. Boink, and then I pinch it, boink. One more to go. All right, so I fold it over and then I twist it. Now, these ends can be a little pokey, so do be careful. Squish. All right, there we go. So now this last one has four. And I just said that, you know, having an odd number of things tends to be more visually pleasing, but we can still use this four, okay? So we have a couple options. If we want to stick with just the threes, you could take one wire and just leave it off to the side and we can make that into something else later. Or you could do what I'm going to do right now. So I'm going to take these four wires and I'm still going to twist them together just like I twisted the other ones. But the what I'm going to do different is once I get just a little ways of the twisting, I'm going to leave one. I'm going to leave one of these things down here, okay? And then I'm going to take these last three and I'm going to twist those ones together, okay? All right, so same thing that I did before, but now I have this extra one. So this extra one is just gonna become a lower piece of the coral. So I'm still gonna bend it over towards the center and I'm gonna twist it, do, 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 twisty, 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 until it's uncomfortable, squish, and then I'm gonna squish it, okay. Now, because this one's a little taller, so that would mean that this coral is a little bit older, um, I'm actually gonna do similar. So I'm gonna, this one's a shorter one, so I'm just gonna still do the same thing. But on these two longer ones, I'm gonna show you one more thing that you can do. And depending on how long your uh, wire is, you can do more or less of this. So on this one, instead of just folding it like this, I'm actually gonna fold it like that, and then I'm gonna squish it out so it looks kind of like a triangle and then squish that center down so now I can make two little teeny short twists and have a couple little shorty pieces okay but it's the same it's the same process right but I just made a couple little teeny shorty twists just to add some variation. So you can see how these ones became shorter. Now, I think for this one over here, I'm gonna do um, just the long one again, cause I think that'll look nice. All right, so twisty, 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 squish. All right, so now this looks kind of like, I don't know, a weird tree or hand or something, I don't know. But what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna stick a couple fingers right here so I can keep a little space in the middle cause that's where I'm gonna need to add some tin foil later. And we'll talk about that in a different video. But so I'm gonna bend this up just slightly and then I'm gonna bend this one up just slightly. And then I'm gonna bend this one up again, just slightly. Now what I'm gonna do when coral is formed, it usually, depending on what kind of coral it is, it doesn't just stick out perfectly straight. It usually has a little bit of a curve to it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just curve these a little bit. So I'm just taking my thumb and kind of pushing the wire around because this wire is super bendy, right? So it's super easy to bend. And then see how I made it kind of a triangle shape where it like sticks out this way, that way, and that way. Uh, that's kind of a good pattern for your coral. So I'm gonna do that on all of my little pieces. Okay, so I'm just kind of like spreading them out and curving them a little bit, right? So this right here looks significantly more like the coral that we were looking at than just the plain wire. Like the seaweed and this coral do look different. This already looks like coral, all right? So there you go. Thanks, everybody.